This is the Grand Coulee Dam, at one time the biggest concrete structure in the whole world. Grand Coulee Dam was created mainly for irrigation, for flood control, and now it generates electric power for the Northwest. I'm right in front of it. This is, there's a visitor center here, that's the Grand Coulee Dam Visitor Center. You can see the water going down the dam. They cut off 260 feet of the original dam over here on the corner. Excavated, excavated farther into the mountain and created this four bay area behind here. This site was done between 1967 and 1974. Our units were done between 1975 and 1980. Basically, the reason this site was done was the physical size of these six new dams. These six alone tripled the total off of the Grand Coulee Dam. The total length of this structure now is 5,223 feet, which is 57 feet short of being a long total mile of length. Over here you'll see these large concrete cases. Inside of those cases are the still line penstocks. They're what take water down to turn your turbines. They're large, they're 40 feet in diameter. You can put three of the largest passenger buses made in there side by side and drive right through it. Move over the silver ball, down through the brown insulator to the cabinet. That's where the cables will land the cabinet. First time units on this end, they're Yellow one down here with the four-line jelly. 
about 350 feet down to the water's edge. And I'm the back of the Grand Coulee Dam. This is the back view of the Grand Coulee Dam. Let's see if I can have a close-up look of the Grand Coulee Dam. This is the back side of the Grand Coulee Dam. You're the one that really wants to do that though, aren't you? <laughs> That's the Grand Coulee Dam. I should, I should grow up. No. That's the Grand Coulee Dam. This is the back side of the Grand Coulee Dam. the hills. Let's take a view of the mountains around Grand Coulee Dam. These are the mountains, they're beautiful, very interesting people.